How do you balance the need for detail with the overall flow and unity of the tattoo? Using detail in such a way that doesn't make a piece too cluttered or busy is important. Yeah, there is a balance there that you want to seek out. So there's a few things I do to try to achieve that balance. First of all, I definitely do aim to have a few shapes that have much less detail. Sometimes I'll stretch detail out, so it'll just create almost like a grain pattern. But there'll be a sense of smooth flow to that, which is a really good counterpoint to any kind of granular, pebbly details. You definitely don't want those kinds of textures covering too much of the piece, or it'll just look chaotic. The other thing is if the shapes themselves that have these details have strong outlines and bold shading, popping them out, in such a way that the texture details are a lot less strong. Let's say that they're done in gray tones and color instead of black. You're still going to be able to read the overall shapes from a distance. What you don't want to do is create camouflage. Make textures that are dark and busy in such a way that the eye is distracted from the overall flow of the major shapes of the piece. You always want to make sure that the strength of those big shapes is greater than the strength of your details and your textures. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to continue on to the next video, click here. To start from the first insight, click here. And if you want to set yourself apart in tattooing, you can follow this link right here.